Hey what's up guys my name is Saurav and welcome to another video for Limit Solutions and this video I'm going to show you how you can use Maps API to implement auto complete address suggestions for your address box so to implement this feature you just have to create a Google console account so you just have to search Google console uh, in Google and once you're done with that just go to this option so this would be the link you just have to create a project so you can just create a project from here and uh, by clicking on this new project and you just give any project name over here and once that is done you just choose that project here from here so once you're done with that so just choose that project and just go to this navigation menu from the on the left from the left side and once you once you click on it you would get this api services so you just have to enable the maps api so do you just click on enable maps APIs and services and here all you have to do is that you just have to search uh, just click on maps enable maps APIs and services here search for uh, maps javascript API or just places API and just click on it and you just need to enable this API so when 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 you'll try to enable this API so this will probably ask you uh, to enter your credit card details or the debit card details because since in a billing is not able for me so once I click on enable billing so here it will ask for me to create a billing account and once I done with that wherein I'll have to enter my credit card details and all so this is a basic uh, kind of uh, form that you have to fill up fill it up so once you're done with it you the APIs will be enabled and then you can get the uh, API for uh, the places API basically you can get it from there so I've already uh, done with my another account and uh, I have the API so I'll just show you how to use it in your application so I'll just going to open Visual Studio code And I'll just choose postman for now and uh, I'll just create a file that is index.html and here I'm just gonna create a boiler template and I'll just add or development over here wherein I'll just have just one input field wherein the type is text that's all and I'll just give the ID and uh, I'll just give a search input let's say and uh, we'll just have to add a few scripts over here so I'll just already have handy so this is the script and we'll just have to use a few uh, script links as well the sources basically the maps so these are the two sources that we're gonna be using in this API or uh, on this uh, for this maps API and this is so this is this is the key that I'm using so I cannot show this key to you guys uh, you just have to get your own because we just we have to pay it for pay for it and here you can see that we are getting this types so accordingly whatever type that you have selected accordingly will just give you the suggestion so I am using live server in order to uh, run the application so once I click on write and if I just click on open with live server just type any like the geo convention center so as you can see that is just working absolutely fine so what exactly is the places types and how you can just get to know okay what kind of places that I want so if you just search on google that places Google API types and once you click on that you can just you just get this first URL from the Google developers wherein you can find all the types so I'm using establishment for now so whatever establishment that are there so I just get all those details here so I'm just using establishment you can use ferrets, floors, foods any like petrol pump, health or like anything that whatever suits you so it's for your application you just configure all those uh, in your application and let's say if I just want the um, airport let's say and if I just configure it so I'll just get the airport details here and if I save it and if I check the application again if I refresh it 
I just search like earlier I searched Geo Convention Center, right? So I would probably not get that now. But if I search any airport as like the Birsa Munda airport, you can see over here we are getting this Birsa Munda airport over here. So accordingly, these are the types, guys. So this is this is what you can conf configure it in your application, and this is how you can use it. So that's it for today, guys. I hope this video is helpful to you. So don't forget to like, subscribe, and then sort of way, stay happy and love to learn new life accelerating technical difficulties. Also, guys, if you have any doubts, any queries regarding like the account creation or the billing creation, and if you face any kind of issues, you can just reach out to me. I'll be happy to help. Thank you so much guys. Bye-bye.